right guys how's it going new age here with some more pokemon tcg online and i have decided i don't know why i'm making like all these changes during this uh during this metagross deck that i've been using um but i have decided that for time's sake basically i'm gonna start just doing like two to three games um just against whatever people instead of doing the tournaments because there's been a lot of times where like it's cool because I win the prizes and then I get to like see if it can go up against like an entire tournament and win like that that's really cool um, but at the same time when I'm trying to record a lot of these it'll like if I win too fast then I have to wait for who knows how long for other games to finish and this and that uh, also the main reason I'm saying all this now is because I just it sucks it really sucks I feel so bad I just recorded a pack opening video where I opened up 36 packs of Ancient Origins on TCG online and I got some pretty sweet pulls and then I realized that I wasn't recording the right screen the whole time so that was really unfortunate so now I'm just like alright I have to record this too but I don't really want to like sit around and have to wait for all the tournament stuff I I wanna just get up into some games so yeah that's what we're gonna be doing now so anyways last episode with the uh, Metagross deck and <laughs> honestly so far it hasn't been amazing which makes me really sad but maybe with just this last episode we can redeem ourselves so let's go ahead and find ourselves a game and see uh, see what's popping with everybody else alright so we found ourselves. oh wow <laughs> We found ourselves a game against a straight up fire deck. I have been playing a lot of camera up decks lately, so I guess camera up is definitely. I mean, I, I've seen how it works, and it does seem to work out pretty well. Uh, seeing as how pretty much every time I play against a Metagross deck, or a Metagross deck, against a uh, camera up deck, it just destroys me. Now, this is just a Torchic. So maybe if it's just a Blaziken deck. I don't think it's just a Blaziken deck. I was gonna say we might have a little bit more time just because I'll have to get set up, not as like where it's a, a camera of DX that could just straight up drop it, but nah, they're definitely they're definitely uh, speeding through nice and fast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, this isn't looking so well for us. Damn. They're getting all kinds of goods going on. Alright, uh, let's see. Well, as much as I'd like to get Swirlix and Slurpuff, I'm going to get another Beldum because I have a feeling that this first one is not going to last me very long. Um, I'll go with the BS Seeker first before Tuna. Yeah, let me get that rare candy ready to go. And I don't know... Okay, I was going to say I don't know if I want to do an energy drop yet, but I will now. Just because I want to see if I get a DCE. So I think that's good for now. Um... I do have an escape rope, so I could switch, so that'll be nice. <clears throat> and I can play a Metagross next turn. The only thing is I don't have any energies yet. And it's going to take me quite a few cards uh, to be able to play Metagross, so... Damn. They're drawing fools! This card, an energy card from your hand, draw two cards. Damn. Damn. They really are drawing a lot with this deck. I should make a fire deck. I don't think I've used a fire deck, like, ever in the longest time. Alright. So, let's see. Um, guard, or not guard press. Machine gun stop does 20. But I have to use... You know, we'll just, we won't count. We'll just go for it and hope for the best, right? Alright, so, let's evolve one. Tier no up. Get some more energy. Okay, okay. So let's see. Uh, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 does just enough to take it out. Or at least I hope I'm counting right and it does do just enough to take it out. Alright, cool. So we did get the Combuskin gone, so that's, I don't know, kind of cool, I guess. But I'm, I'm scared. Because they, they have things like, uh, you know, Blacksmith and all that. They could super energy accelerate and just have enough energy on anything out of nowhere. What I'm most afraid of is if they got a rare candy and they want to drop, like, a, a Blaziken out of nowhere. 
Because Blaziken can mess me up. I'm sure. Any Blaziken. Oh my gosh. Like a Blaziken EX. Where the... What? I forgot that was even a card, honestly. I've never even seen anyone play this. Oh, it's cool. Alright. So, we're clearly not doing too great right here. I'm going to go ahead and throw the Lucky Helmet down now. Um, Drop that double colorless. I've actually seen some other variants of this deck uh, since I started playing this, which makes me sad. Uh, yeah, hell yeah. Let me get rid of that. Finally. Uh, yeah. Hey, at least we're getting the heads. Right? Alright, not that time. But, that's not bad. Alright, we still need to... Oh, hell the... Yeah, I was trying to say hel hello and hell yeah. I don't know what I'm saying. All right, all right. So we have the lucky helmet on Metagross. Uh, let's see, 80, 90, or not 80, damn, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 90, 120. Oh no! Oh wow, really missing out on that knockout by like 10 damage. Well. That sucks. Alright. So. Oh, what? No. Oh, that's right. Okay. That worked out then. Because um, of his attack, taking less damage. So we, we wouldn't have had it either way. I'm pretty sure we're going to die next turn. But we'll draw two cards off of the Lucky Helmet. Then we can draw three cards off of Tyranno next turn on top of our normal draw. So we... This uh, Entei is definitely going to die. Oh, really? It's up with 10 HP. Damn. I would have loved for it to kill itself, because then I could just go straight after that, uh, that blaze again. Now, do I want to bring out the Slurpuff and draw two more? No, I think I need to go with the Beldum. Alright. Let's see. So I'm pretty sure this Entei will just go down no matter what uh, this turn. So we'll just get some cards going. Um, I guess I'm waiting for the right time to use the Sacred Ash too. I think we're still pretty good. Can I get another Beldum? Yeah, that's what I need. All right, another Beldum, and we are running low on Metagross apparently. Alright, so this thing should die no matter what. Um, I think I'll put the Lucky Helmet on there. Get the energy on there. Oh. <laughs> Sorry about that. Things going but ding So, the thing I notice, we don't have very many Metagross. They must all be prized or some junk. So, we'll have to hope we can draw into one next turn somehow. Or get one off the priors. Nope, we don't. Okay. <laughs> That's alright. I honestly... I mean, if we could get past this Blaziken, then, you know, maybe, but... It's not looking... It's not looking very, uh... Very fine on our side. Oh my gosh. Alright, so Flare Storm. Damn. That's totally not even necessary. I wonder if we could kill it next turn. We'll have to draw the Metagross, though. Damn! <laughs> Alright, let's see. Yeah, because if all my Metagross are in there, then... I kind of don't have a choice. Alright, let's see. Uh... So let's get all those back. Now I need to... I need to draw into him. <laughs> Tierna. Oh, we have Lugia on this deck. I forgot about that. <laughs> See, I don't even know. Alright, Trainer's Mail. Can we get, like, an Ultra Ball or something? Do I even have an Ultra Ball in this deck? I have 11 cards left in my deck. Oh, it's getting a little laggy now. I don't know why. Alright, so, we're back. And turns out my internet stopped working, so the game just kind of froze and then crashed and then all kinds of bad stuff happened. But I would like to count that as a win for me. Not really, though. We were about to get destroyed, probably. I mean, even if I drew into stuff like 
I, t I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like it wouldn't have gone well. I mean, I was trying. I would have liked to see if I could have one shot that Blazer King, because I had, like, my whole deck in my hands. <laughs> so, anyways, we're going to jump into another game. We'll probably I'll, I'll go ahead and do two more for this video, just because, obviously, that one didn't count, but I also didn't want to just, like, delete it and backtrack, because I don't like to do that, either. I don't like to act like stuff didn't happen like that, you know? Uh, so, anyways, next battle. Let's go. Alright, so we found a game right away. This time against the Psychic, Normal, and Fighting deck. Uh, I don't know what that would be. That might be a Golurk deck. I wouldn't know, though. I can't draw nothing. I didn't see any, any electric or fire types, though. So, I don't know why my mouse is lagging all over the place. So, it might not be, just because it, it wouldn't have Jolteon and Flareon. So, I don't know what the heck's going on. Um, I'll go ahead and throw the Lucky Helmet on Lugia. Um, let's get some energies out of the deck before we start drawing. And... Do I want to attach... Hell, let's, let's see if we just win this with Lugia. <laughs> right? I actually should have gone... Damn it, yeah. I was going to say, I actually should have gone for the Slurpuff, because other than that, I have no way to draw cards in my hand. So that kind of sucks. I mean, he could attack us, yeah, but... You know. You know. We don't, we don't need to be attacked to draw cards. That's just like a benefit. Alright, so going for a Karina. I still don't know. This might just actually be a fighting deck with... Actually, Mewtwo isn't even in the, in the format anymore. So I have no idea <clears throat> what the Psychic Pokemon was. I'm a little confuzzled, gotta admit. But hey, we see a Lucario, so that's cool. And he could just retreat and attack me. TBH. <laughs> now do 30, 50, 70. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a... What? I didn't know you could still do a Bats Fighting deck. Without Landorus, Landorus is what makes it awesome. That was, ah, that's still one of my favorite decks. I love it so much. <laughs> so we're going to get to draw two, and like I said, I don't really have anything. So that's really sad. Um, I think I'll put a Muscle Band on Veldum. Just kind of assume we'll draw stuff later on. So we hit Lucario for 80. Uh, let's see, 60, 80, 100, but we do resist it, so they would have to attach another uh, strong energy for Corkscrew Smash to one-shot us. And I hope they don't have that, or a fighting stadium. They actually have plenty of options to be able to just take out Lugia, and there it is. Damn! <laughs> so Lugia is going to go down here. I don't even know what to do. I think I'll just send out Swirlix, I guess. Hope I live. He's not even having to use that. Actually, that was another thing. He could have just he could have just evolved Golbat into Golbat, and that would take me out. Either way. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Well, it's kind of like this deck works, yeah. But it more just works because of Lucario. Like, you really don't need the, the bats in here. Like, you could just run a straight-up Lucario deck, and it's good because it's got the no resistance, the draw power, and then just, like, a straight-up hard-hitting move. So, yeah, so that'll hit us for 100. So he honestly didn't even need the... Well, I mean, he could just use a regular energy. So we are going to draw two more cards... I don't know if I'd be able to take out the Lucario yet. I mean, also, you know, we don't have a... We don't have a Metagross. There's a Metagross. Ooh! And we get the Slurpuff. Okay. Alright, so Slurpuff. We could draw two. We could drop the energy. And evolve. And now we just hope that he doesn't Lysander us. Or something like that in the next turn. Oh, I forgot we could have two uh, items. So let's see, 20, 40, 
50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120 is what we're hitting for right now, <clears throat> which is not bad. I think I'll put the Lucky Helmet on Metagross, just in case he does Lysander, then at least, you know, I could draw off of it. Because right now, if he attaches just a regular third fighting energy, then Somersault Kick is already going to be hitting for 160, so that already takes us out. So damn, that's a lot of damage right there. So just go ahead. Take out my Slurpuff, we'll call it a day. I hate there's those times when you just really want them to take out that one Pokemon. And then when they take out the other one, it's just like, no! Screws you over. I, I'd say if he is, yeah, okay. If he is gonna just take out my Slurpuff, the smart move would be... Oh no, don't get Escape Rope. No, not Escape Rope. Do you really need escape rope in this deck? Like you got Golbat and Halucha. I'm scared now. Please don't have an escape rope. Okay, he went for a level ball. Good. That's what I like to see. So what I was going to say was if he is going to attack Slurpuff, the smart thing to do would be attach energy to Lucario. His other one, because otherwise this thing is just going to die. Even though he could put plenty of damage on my Metagross already. It's already at 120. Yeah, because he could still use an escape rope and then just retreat with the Golbat or anything. Damn! I wonder if I'll, I'll try and make like a... Oh. I guess that's not horrible. I mean, we, we missed out on a KO for the Lucario, but Slurpuff does only have one retreat cost, so we could still kind of just put an energy on and retreat it. Plus, get to draw on top of that. Now, the Focus Sash really sucks. That really sucks. Okay, so actually, let me undo that, because I want to make sure we got plenty of cards. Alright, so let's see. Right now, 40... 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Oh no! Do I have anything else to help me draw? <laughs> because I still need an energy to take out, to remove the slur puff from right there. Alright, alright, screw it. We're just gonna play super risky. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use the trainer's mail, get a roller skates, flip heads. It's not a roller skates. Alright, we got one more time. Damn it! Okay, so let's see. So just to make sure, hitting for 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. That's so upsetting. Well, if that's the case, then screw it. I'm just going to get another uh, Beldum ready to go. I'm just going to retreat, attack with this one, and then next turn I can drop another one. Because I wasn't going to take it out either way. That might be getting a little reckless for setting me up for the next Lucario, but I can't one-shot the next Lucario anyway, so <laughs> joke's on them. Uh, they could go after... I don't see why they're going after Metagross. Well. Yeah, because they have the strong energies in their hand. So, I mean, hey. Um, alright. So, I can for sure take out this.
this one next uh, this turn. Ooh, didn't even have to use the level ball. All right. So let's keep on drawing, and let's drop another Beldum. Let's evolve this one. Get the energy, and wah! Nope. Okay. All right. Let's see. How many Metagross do we have? Ooh, we only have those. Okay. Uh, I would like to get that the Sacred Ash now. Okay, nope. Eh, escape Rope won't do me any good. Yeah, Tierno. There we go. Should I wait till this one's dead to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just go for it. Alright, so that Lucario's gonna go down. We did get another Metagross, so that's really awesome. Uh, the only problem is we don't have any double colorless energies to drop onto this spell. How many have we used? I'm sure we have... Okay, we have one left in the deck. Or, maybe prized. Who knows? And they seem to be doing just fine going through uh, all their Lucarios. Alright, so they won't hit us for that much. Uh, if they start... They have it all set up now to just start using the... Uh... What the heck? Alright. A message from our sponsors um <laughs> anyways anyways uh they do have it like perfectly set up to just start using crobat and stuff just like return that one to the hand then drop them all the next turn <sighs> so that's gonna be scary they'll definitely rack up damage super fast that way so can they take me out next turn i wish i have a hundred that's already hitting for 80. Yeah, they could take me out next turn. Alright. So no matter what, this should just like two shot it. I, I can't one shot it. So it, it doesn't really matter how much I use right now. I just want to make sure the other Metagross is ready to go. How many Bellums have I used? One, two, three. Do I still have one more? Oh, I do. Yes. All right. That works out pretty awesome, too. All right. Oh, there's another double colorless. Hell yeah. All right. So I'll use the other Metagross next turn. And then I think I'll try and use Lugia after that. But also, the Crobats going on my bench is... I'm, I'm, I'm running out of run out of prizes here not doing so hot all right so Lucario will be able to take me out next or this turn and then I can use the other Metagross to take out this Lucario so after that we'll see what happens um, I do have a Lysander so maybe I can win this oh pick up that shaman just knock it out yo we might win I think we might win I think we might win! <laughs> Alright, let's see. Um, so, we definitely don't need much to knock out. Yeah, and I'm gonna go ahead and add these back up in my deck. And, let's see, let's see. I don't think we have any more muscle bands. I, I really don't think we need them. I'm just gonna draw more. Actually... I forgot we evolved with rare candies. I'm so stupid. I don't think I have any more rare candies. <laughs> oh, I'm a smart guy. I would like to... What the hell? I forgot Kangaskhan was in this deck. I would like to get Lugia going, though. Um, so now I need to chill out and not draw so much. So then I could have Lugia ready to go. And all I need to do is Lysander that Shaman. And then it's good game. Ah, uh, hello. Yo, we actually did it. Noise. <laughs> Noise. We've beaten the fighting Crobats deck. Uh, as long as they don't take me out in this turn, which I don't see how they can. Because at most they could put like one energy on a Lucario. And I guess I could do like 50, 60, 60. Or yeah, 60. 
Yeah, they shouldn't be able to take me out this turn, no matter what. No matter what. Oh, dang. <laughs> oh, I think we're gonna get it. Okay, they're going after a Slurp Puff. Oh. If they have a Lucario. Maybe. Maybe they could go after my Beldum. If they take out Slurpuff and Beldum. I don't know how they could do that though. I'm sure there's a way. But I don't want there to be a way. I just want them to lose. Mmm, yes. Victory is near. It seems like they do not have much. Mm. I don't see any Lucarios. Ah, uh, yeah. Gonna, gonna get that GG ready to be all typed out. Come on, man. The pressure is too much. I just want them to die. Not in real life, just in this game. I want them to die and lose all of their cards. What? That doesn't even work on Crobat. What you doing? Hello? <laughs> yeah, okay, clearly this guy has nothing. If he's putting focus sashes on his Crobats, what? Dang. So, like, they have the, the Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeons that, like, change the types. Imagine if they have a fighting EV with a similar effect, you know, way in the future. And make all your Pokemon fighting, and they could use all these. That'd be insane! Alright, so that Golbat can take out the Slurpuff. Oh, uh, what's gonna happen here? Easy. Okay, cool. This is gonna take a prize. <laughs> and then I will say, G. Oh, not in all caps, though. That seems obnoxious. GG. And hurry before he rage quits. <laughs> you always, you always got to get that kill in before they rage quit. All right, so we'll get one more game. So I'll say like, so we won this one. I'll say we lost the other one. So we got one more shot, and we'll consider this the the tiebreaker of whether or not this deck worked out for us or not. So one more game. Let's do it. All right, last game. Let's see who we're up against. Water, electric, fire, and fighting. Is this a Dawn fan deck with the Vaporeon? Or with the Vaporeon, with the Evolutions? Because I know that's a thing. Or at least I think that's a thing. So, might as well drop both the. Oh no, it's a Diglett deck! I wanna make this deck. <laughs> An Elemental Dug Trio. I actually don't know what the Doug Trio does, because I haven't looked into it yet, but I do want to make this deck. <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright, alright. So... Dang, we could have a... Uh, freaking two Slurpuffs going. <clears throat> would, would they take us out next turn? Would they really... Could they do that? 60 HP... They do have a muscle band. They could practically kill us with mud slap. Yeah, I'm gonna get Beldum. <laughs> I wasn't gonna, but it's not looking so hot. Alright, let's just equip this stuff now. And assume we're just magically gonna have a Metagross next turn. Damn! Earthquake is crazy. Yeah, so they're gonna kill us just with Earthquake. Damn! One energy, 60 damage? That's why that's good. That's nice. Dang. They're not even using the right Eevee! What the heck? <laughs> Alright, so let's drop this Slurpuff right here. Uh, let's get some energies out of the deck. Draw two cards. Draw three cards. Uh, uh, draw three more cards. Yeah! And let's see. Uh, 
Alright. Rare candy. Noise. And lucky helmet. Because apparently that's what we're destined to draw. And I really don't want to... I don't even want to try and send Kangaskhan out there. Um... I mean, the trio doesn't have much HP, so that's nice. We just need to be able to get a freaking Metagross going. So next turn, we'll be able to draw a pretty decent amount of cards, too. Um, and they actually can't take us out with Earthquake unless they attach a strong energy, because that'll only hit us for 80, so... And we're not weak to any of the evolutions. <clears throat> so that would be pretty cool if we could draw two more cards next turn. Let's see what happens. I would appreciate it if they didn't kill us. Oh, they could get Flareon ready, though. Damn. That's annoying. So, Dugtrio will be hitting nice and hard. Then again, though, just doing 60, uh, that actually won't be enough to take us out, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so, we'll get the last steel energy out of the deck. We'll draw two more. And where's the Metagross? Yo! I don't think we'll need Muscle Band, honestly. I can't find Metagross! You will need to draw more! Ah. Yo, what the hell? How much of my deck have I drawn? I still don't have a Metagross? What? Alright, uh... Let's start getting... Let's start getting Lugia powered up, just because it's not weak to fire. So that's nice. And, I don't know, just in case. Just in case. Uh, muscle Band. I'll put Lucky Helmet on this Beldum in case he wants to Lysander it out. You know, God, just do a bunch of planning ahead. Alright, <clears throat> so honestly, we'd be in a much better... Much better? A much better position if we were drawing Metagrosses. I need to check my deck and see where they're all at. Also, that sucks that he counted the stadium because that's the only silent lab we run. So now he's taking no damage. Let's see. 20, 40, 60, 80. If I get a muscle band, Lugia can actually knock it out. Where are my Metagross at? Huh. Damn it. Okay. Well, no Muscle Band. Damn. Deep Hurricane can get rid of the stadium, though. That's nice. Oh, he can also evolve that into a Jolteon next turn. Damn it. Yeah, he had all of them. I was like, did he have Jolteon? Yeah, he had all of them. We only have 10 cards in our deck. How have we not drawn a Metagross yet? Yo, if we lose this because we drew through our whole deck and didn't get a Metagross, then I'm just going to have to say it. This deck is boo-boo. Damn. Damage. Yeah, they could definitely get Jolteon. Yo, this deck is so good. You can use Level Ball to get like everything in your deck, too. Damn. I can't wait to make this deck. I'm making it ASAP. And you get some to counter stadiums. That's nice. That's nice. Alright. Just don't drop a Jolteon, and we'll be good. Damn, that still did so much. Do you have a Lysander? Actually, no, I have to take out this Duck Trio. Uh, let's do that, and... Oh! No, I can't do that, my bad. Let's do that! I still haven't drawn anything. I mean, I guess I'll try... At this rate, I... I'll deck out. I still haven't gotten a Metagross, oh my gosh. Yo, show all cards. 
There's one Metagross in my deck. Oh my gosh! All right, can we can we get some off prizes? <laughs> All right, so as long as they don't play a Jolteon, we can live one more turn. And getting rid of the stadium is nice, too. Getting rid of the Flareon would be really nice, actually. Oh, come on! Don't 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 be like that. Don't be that guy. All right, so it didn't take us out. I actually want to Lysander out the Flareon. Because I'm just going to end up dying next turn either way. So I could at least have... Should I Lysander out Flareon? Should I get rid of this Doug Trio? Uh, <laughs> the trio or Flareon. <laughs> so if I take out the trio now, yeah, I think I think I'm just gonna take out the trio. Put the energy right there, and I can actually get Lugia back after it goes down. So that's something. How much am I doing? Two. Wait. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Oh, okay. I was about to say. Alright, there you go. We get a Metagross. Alright. So we're looking in a bit of a better position. I can add more Pokemon to my deck with the Sacred Ash. And the trio will go down next turn. Well, actually, I think I'll grab Flareon. And then from there, I can start hitting better and if he wants to play another Flareon then damn I was gonna say did that not take us out all right so I'd rather go with the muscle band we only have two Pokemon left all right so one two blah 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 all right so let's play this Metagross and I think I'm gonna grab Flareon Honestly, though, they're so far ahead in prizes, like, damn. It's just too close. Especially if they Lysander out my other Beldum. And we got this Metagross off the prizes, so there is still one in our deck. And damn! Okay. That's not cool. 60, 80, 100. So I won't take us out, actually. Uh... I think I want to Lysander out this Duck Trio because it's just crazy strong right now. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do that. Uh... No, can I still win this? Can I get some Metagrosses? I can't do this. I can't. I can't Metagross without Metagross. 60, 80. Oh, that won't take us out. Don't have a Muscle Band. No! Why would you do that? That's gonna help you get a muscle band. If he doesn't have a muscle band, I get ahead in prizes. No, 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 no. No, 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 no! Damn. Actually, that doesn't matter. I could lie Sandra the Eevee. Yes! Alright, now I just need a Metagross! There we go. Alright, so I'll take out that Duck Trio. A damage! And now we can just grab the Eevee next turn! Oh my gosh! Does he even have energies to hit me with? Oh, okay, he does. <laughs> He's gonna play Jolteon, but it doesn't matter! Yes! Oh, that works. That works! Hey, we did it! <laughs> I'm gonna tell him GG. Because it is most definitely GG. Bam! Bo bam Got him! 
Ah, nice. With two cards left in our deck, too. That's how Metagross gets it done. Not bad. Oh, dang. Metagross v Duck Trio. Ah. Okay, okay. So, maybe the deck wasn't so boo-boo after all. We did come back. It does make me a little sad that the Metagross deck beat the Duck Trio deck because I want to make the Duck Trio deck. So, we'll see. Maybe, I mean, maybe we'll get lucky with it. I don't know. Clearly, we got lucky a lot with this deck because this deck, I will say, even though we did good this episode, is not the greatest. <laughs> Especially with all the Flareons running around. But anyways, that is going to conclude our Metagross deck, and in the next episode, we'll have us a different deck, so if you're excited for that, leave a like, and also I would like to say, uh, if you guys want, comment down below with deck suggestions for decks you would like to see me use, because I don't think I've done that for now, I've just had decks that I really wanted to use, and I've just been making them on here and using them. Um, granted, I still have that mentality, so if no one comments stuff, I have decks, but... I would like to hear some uh, crazy deck suggestions for things I might not have thought of that uh, you guys would want to see. So be sure to do that down below. And that being said, I'm going to get up on now. So until then, I'm New Age Still. Keep on watching. And I will see you guys next time. Later.